Okay, we're on Orla, Perak Bet, Mishnah Yud Gimel, 13th Mishnah and the second chapter of Orla. Very interesting Mishnah. The Mishnah says the following, Kelim Sachan Let's say I have a shoe or a baseball glove or whatever, you know, a leather, uh, a leather utensil, a leather item. Sachan, Lasuch means to anoint it, or I mean, I, I, I smeared it with oil, but the oil was Tameh. Right? Then, Sacham Tahor. And then I went back and I re smeared it, I re, uh, uh, what's the word? I oiled it with Tahor oil. Okay, and the Bartsuner says the following. He's talking about the following. Kigon min alim, keilim, shoes, or a baseball glove. Okay? Ve'achash sacham b'tam b'tamei. I, I, ve'chazar b'sacham b'tam b'tamei. When did I go re-oil them? La'achar sheni j'abeh sh'sham b'na rishon. V'it b'lo l'kli sh'nitma b'sham b'tamei. So what happened? I have this shoe, and then I, or a baseball glove, and I, and I rubbed it with the oil, and then it dried, so I, but it's tamei. So what I did, I said, okay, to the mikvah. And now it's tahor, great. And then I re-oiled it. I re-oiled my baseball glove with shemen tahor. Or the, the, I did it the other way around. First, I did shemen tahor. Vechaza vechazacham shemen tamei. And then I re-anointed it with shemen tamei. And then it dried, and then I took it to the mikvah. So now it's tahor. The problem is, though, then what happened was, ukishemish tamshim, the Bartinura says, ukishemish tamshim bakli niflat Hashem and lachutz. So when I, when I use the whatever, it's dry, it's a little bit oily, but whatever, it, it dried out, fine. But now when I use the glove, I can really get a good workout with this baseball glove. Okay, niflat Hashem lachutz. Oil comes out. And we want to know now, this oil that comes out, is it tahor oil or is it tamay oil? So there's, I remember when I learned computer science, there's two, like, there's, there's two uh, rules, about, about this, I, rules about this concept in computers. Okay, the first one, let me see if I can find it. Oh, we'll dedicate the learning to the memory of my father, Rab Simcha Ben Yitzchak Kalman. And here's my email address if you want to contact me. I just thought I, when I went in computers, we were learning like searching and sorting and all that kind of stuff. So there was like, there we go. There was two, there was two rules. There was FIFO, which is what's called first in, first out. Okay, so meaning when you, when you do a sort or a search, I, I vaguely remember this. Or there's LIFO, right, which is last in, first out. And that's what the Mishnah wants to know about our shemen. Is it fifo? Okay, that the, the if it shemen tame is first, then when you come when it comes that when you use it, the shemen tame is coming out. Or fifo or lifo last last in first out, and whatever comes in within last comes out. Rabbi Lezer, Omer, Rabbi Lezer says achar harishon aniba first in first out. Okay, so therefore if the shemen tame went in first, therefore when you reuse it, that which was in there comes out. No, you follow the last one. The last in, first out. And therefore, if the last one you do was Tamei, then the shaman that come out when I reused my baseball glove is Tamei. And the same thing if it was Tahor. Uh, it's a really interesting question whether the, the, is this a scientific attitude of the Chazal or it's a halachic one. I don't really know how to answer that question. One gets a sense that they really felt that this was the scientific reality. And what would be nowadays, what would they say nowadays if someone could, you know, take a microscope and, or, or, or dye, take a, let's take a dye and we'll actually follow the oil. I personally get a sense, I mean, I don't know, there's a rabbi lesson in we have to follow halacha. What would happen nowadays? The Sanhedrin would have to reevaluate. One does have the sense that it's both, that the, the oils that become in, in, you know, sucked into the baseball glove or the shoe get mixed in together and both Tameh and Tahor come out. But who really knows? And uh, so then when, when they build the Sanhedrin, We'll have to figure it out. All right, have a good day.